Hello everyone, in the section today on the conditional form mapping, um, I'd like to share this how to uh, change the, the font size and the color um, of the text uh, you know, in the visualization. So, uh, look into, this, uh, into my screens now. You can see I have, I use this uh, superstore data and then you can see here the subcategories. And uh, we have revenues, uh, margin, uh, profit ratio, and then a, a number of a customer here. And what I did is the customer who have the profit negative will be highlighted in the different color, in the bold formatting. Um, and, and also I put the font size is bigger. Right? So three things I can do in this uh, exercise is um, change the color, change the font size, and um, change the format which he bolted it up. Okay. So how to do this? Uh, well, we can do this very easy in the Excel, but in the Tableau it becomes uh, more complex. So I will share with you how to do this one. Alright. Um, I this is uh, the dashboard, but before I uh, combine all the view to visualization in the dashboard, I have two separate um, uh, uh, worksheet here. Okay, it's most important in this worksheet, okay. um, and how I can change the color and then change the font size uh, and the format of the words here. So I will build the blank one, and then I will share with you how to do. It. So first of all, uh, you can see in my uh, screen, I have five columns, but four columns is about the data, and then we do the format in the data only. So, um, if we just, if we just um, print the uh, data like the normal way, like if I print the um, categories in here, and subcategory, uh, uh, subcategory to here. And if I only bring the sales into the view, so here's uh, we we cannot change the color and change the form sign here. Right? So what I'm gonna do is I will create a different um, different column, and then uh, we can. Uh, we can work in the each individual column. Right? The first one that I do is just create this. Just create a dummy column. Okay? So, so I have one. Uh, I will control and then drag and drop two, three, four columns. Right? Okay. And the first column I will print which is the revenue. In the revenue, we have uh, two types of words. One is normal, and one is in the boat one. So, um, I create, pre-create these sales boat calculated field. So I say, if the profit is negative, so sum of sale. And then I do another one with it, exactly the same, uh, but it's different condition. If the profit is positive, and sum of sale. So we actually what we did is. To print the um, sales in to divide the sale into two sections it want a uh, with a positive um, uh, profit and one with negative profit um, now I go into the first one we see the first column so I print the sales both and the sales normal into the view All right, so this number, it actually appear into the label. If we go into the label, and you see it's actually here is sale boat, uh, we can make it a little bigger, which it means we change the form size. We can put that in the boat, and we can change the color. I put it in the red color. Right? 
and again we print it side by side to put it in a one light and then I apply it so actually you can see in here the one with the with the negative profit already changed in here so I will go to another one with the one with normal right so I go into check to the format I think some um, let's allow the overlap in order to the full screen support. so now you can see it's actually uh, with the one uh, the sale with the negative profits already already formatted in the different form size in the boat and different color um, so now if we want to remove um, on the light here and then to get the alignment for the word uh, what we can do is uh, we can change this one to the uh, um, rain bar right? um, and then remove all the color and in the word here I think it uh, on the alignment you can do uh, move it alignment by the right hand side okay. so now you can see it all the words is on your line what you can do next is just remove the below here okay so the first column is done the sales and the one with the negative profit will be in a different size different color and in the boat format right okay so i go to the second column we see the profit so it should do the same I just do the same. So I, I create uh, two calculated fields, which is profit boat and profit normal. Profit boat is a profit negative, some profit. Profit normal, if profit positive, some profit. And then I go to the second column. I bring the boat and normal together into the label. Go to label overlapped um, and then on the boat put it different size different color and put it in the boat and print it on the front Apply OK so now we have a second column done easy simple so we can go to the east, third column we see the profit ratio so i print the profit ratio both and normal into the label with from size crown boat color and print normal int okay allow to be overlapped Ah, so this one we can change to the percentage, right? This is the profit ratio. So, um, it, if I go to right click in here, here I can change to the percentage. One decimal. Do the same for the second one. Percentage. One decimal. So we can have. So we can have. The last one will be. The total per customer so we see we see what i can do is um, just do the same thing with the customer so with the customer boat and the customer normal and i bring it and should do the repeated the same the same uh, step by step right? out here out here boat Draw boat red color and oh, yeah. 
Okay, so this is the one. So at the end, there we have uh, we have uh, four columns, and then the one with the uh, negative profit will be appear like this red, bigger size in the book. Right. Uh, what we can do is so now, what we can do is to print this one uh, into the dashboard. And you know, it, uh, when I do the same white, I create a four uh, column, and each column I put a title in here. The same, the same way I, I create the, I create the uh, this one. So now I go into the dashboard. I will print the title in, and I will print this data in. Just hide the title. Hide the title. Hmm. This one, it um, if I go here and put it uh, entire view oh, in here, you can do entire view. Oh, okay. Um, from here you can see actually the uh, title is not uh, quite aligned with the column here so that's why I print the one of the dummies uh, visualization in here and then just uh, just the title just in order to put this the title to the right position okay so now to, um, if you can do the, a couple of the formatting to remove the uh, border uh, color you know the um, title here uh, and then you can see the what you you can see you you can get what you want to do the formatting to what uh, in a in a in a in a, in a distinctive uh, color distinctive size and then in the boat or, uh, or italic whatever you want okay so i hope you find this one useful um, I, um, if you have any question or comment feel free to put that in my uh, in my top of tiktok uh, channel uh, happy to uh, to help have a great day guys bye bye